Sephora, known for her ornate bridal gowns and ready-to-wear collection, is here. Let's see what she has in store for us this season. We're using one of OPI's most iconic shades. It's a soft pink called Bubble Bath. And the great thing, I've got it right here. The great thing is, it's, it's a step into pink for spring. And what's springier than pink? show with lead hairstylist DDA Milage. Can you describe to me the look that you're creating? Well, the collection is inspired by the 20th century couture and by the images of uh, basically three photographers, uh, Irving Penn, Richard Avedon, and Cecil Beaton. about uh, getting inspired by the mid 20th century, the 30s up to the 50s. And I was thinking about this woman that lived then and was uh, living in Paris in a, and dressing in couture. What would she want to wear today if she was living today? Here we are backstage at Rima Kra in New York Fashion Week. Um, these are two my dresses. They are really beautiful. So this one goes first. And this has um, kind of a more sexy vibe, as you can see a little bit of skin and it's quite transparent and I really like the color, I think it suits me. And my second one is more feminine, more evening gown I would say and it's really nice laces in here and quite transparent as well but more sophisticated I feel. I love them both. It's going to be a beautiful show, beautiful ladies. Very long dresses. Well, I'm so lucky I have like the most beautiful dress in the collection. It's this blue cold dress with a great embroidery. So I think it's perfect like for date or like, I don't know, for maybe even for wedding, like, you know, more than wedding dress. So I'm so excited to be in this dress. your brand apart from other brands? I think I have a hand that is different than, than everybody else. My hand, my details, and I do have perhaps a little bit of a French twist. Meaning I went to school in Paris, I speak French, I have a very French, you know, kind of set of mind. And there is some couture hand in here that perhaps another brand wouldn't have. about the fabrics that you're using to create this aesthetic? I think this collection, I have the most variety of fabric you can ever see. We've printed all our fabrics. We dyed all our colors, all the florals, that the prints that you see here, are, uh, we, we did them in-house. And uh, so there's everything you can imagine. There is something creative about designing a collection of ready-to-wear and mixing colors and uh, going with the concept and uh, something that's challenging to to the mind and has a cultural effect and uh, is intellectual in many ways. So it's very exciting, challenging, and uh, it's, this is what I love to do. Yeah. 